Welcome to ReplacementLaptopKeys.com. In this video, we will show you how to remove and install a regular ABC size key. From the bottom corner underneath the keycap, release it from the hinge by pulling upwards. To remove the hinge, apply pressure on the top left corner of the hinge diagonally to the bottom right corner. Insert the screwdriver underneath the bottom right hinge to release the mount, and do the same for the bottom left mount. This should release the pressure from the two top inner hinges so that you will be able to slide it from under the remaining two top mounts. The reason why it's important to remove the bottom mounts first is to not damage the tabs on either side of the inner hinge that slide underneath the top mounts. To install the hinge, there are two ways to know that the hinge is correct side up. One, the bottoms of the outer hinge will lay flat against the keyboard. And two, the bottom of the inner hinge will be able to flip upwards. To install the hinge, first locate your two top mounting points and then hook the two upper tabs of the inner hinge into the mounting points. Next, place your finger on the top of the hinge and slowly push downwards to the bottom until both bottom hinges are secured in place. Before reinstalling the keycap, make sure that all tabs are intact and not bent for it to be reinstalled correctly. Center the keycap over the hinge. Once aligned, push down and it should snap into place. In this video, we will show you how to install a small keycap. To install the hinge, there are two ways to know that a hinge is correct side up. One, the bottoms of the outer hinge will lay flat against the keyboard. And two, when you tap down on the top of the inner hinge, the bottom will flip upwards. Now align the two upper tabs of the inner hinge by hooking them under the top mounts. Once the tabs are hooked into the top mounts, Place your finger on the top of the hinge and slowly push downwards to the bottom until the hinge is secured in place. Before reinstalling the keycap, make sure that all tabs are intact and not bent for it to be reinstalled correctly. Now match the tabs on the keycap to the correct placement on the hinge to ensure that it is installed right side up. Center the keycap over the hinge, once aligned, push down, and it should click into place. In this video, we will show you how to install a large keycap. Before installing the hinge, there are two ways to know that the hinge is correct side up. One, the bottoms of the outer hinge will lay flat against the keyboard, and two, the front of the inner hinge will be able to flip upwards freely. To install the hinge, align the two upper tabs of the inner hinge by hooking them under the upper mounting points. Once the tabs of the inner hinge are hooked into the upper mounting points, 
place your finger on the top of the hinge and slowly push downwards towards the bottom until the hinge is secured in place. Now repeat and do the same for the opposite side. To install the stabilizer bar, first secure it into place on the keycap. Before reinstalling the keycap, make sure that all tabs are intact and not bent to ensure that it will be reinstalled correctly. There is a mounting point for each end of the stabilizer bar. Next, install both ends of the stabilizer bar by inserting them into the mounting points. Then center the keycap over the hinge and once aligned, push down and you should hear it snap into place. Please give us a thumbs up if you thought the video was helpful, or comment below on what you'd like to see more videos of. If you need to purchase a replacement key, please visit replacementlaptopkeys.com or click on the link below. Thanks for watching.